everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and remember to share Ivorian Spice because sharing Ivorian Spice is caring guys. Boom! And today guys, Real Sociedad nil, Manchester United 4, Manchester United going 4 goals up against Real Sociedad in the first leg of the Europa League. I think, I believe it's the last 32, yes, it's going to be a long one in the Europa League, but yes, Manchester United winning it 4-0 convincingly as well, you know, good performance from the lads today, you know, come on guys, it's a brilliant win. Brilliant win for United after a disappointing weekend against West Brom. I still can't believe that we drew against those scum. It still still hurts me today, like till day, till today. But yes, with this performance, you know, it just makes it up, you know. Because I was upset with you, Manchester United. I was that like, upset. You know, I feel like, no, I'm not talking to you. Now, you know, saying sorry to me, bad times. And then after suddenly you buy me some jewelry, I'm like, <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm talking to you now. And right now, I'm talking to you, Manchester United, man. <laughs> I'm talking to you, you get me? And with that win, guys, it makes it easier for us to probably rest some players in the second leg, you know? You know, or just add more to it, you know, because the, the tie is pretty much done. But we have to be careful and keep our mentality straight because we're not just through yet. we still got second leg. Don't just think because we're throwing it up. We can just throw it away. Nah. First 20 minutes, guys. Poof. It was a decent start. Manchester United starting off, creating a couple of good chances. Marks Rashford missing a couple of chances, of course, in that first half. CPU crashed down a couple of times, making the wrong decision. Typical Marcus Rashford, as usual. McSauce as well, missing a very good chance in that first 20 minutes. And then, of course, our saviour, Bruno Fernandes, scoring a goal, of course. Real Sociedad doing a madness with their defence, you know. Guys, I am not going to lie to you. At that moment there, when I saw their madness of their defence, for a second there, I thought it was Maguire Lindelof and the Hill. Until I just had to do this and like, raw. Because raw, that's the type of shit that Maguire Lindelof and the Hill would do, you know. And they replicated that. But thank God it wasn't us, guys. I'm pleased that Bruno Fernandes scored, waiting for his opportunity, and just slotted it in after they done their madness. And then it was 1-0 at half-time. All I've got to say that is I know that Mark Rashford himself probably went down to the tunnel and took his limitless pill. You get me, guys? He definitely took his limitless pill for the second half because as soon as he took those pills, yes, I know what to do. I know how to score. Kylian Mbappe is not better than me. Project Marcus Rashford better than Mbappe because everything worked well for Marcus Rashford in the second half. His passing and his decision making was making sense. I was like, yeah, limitless pill is working for him, bruv. You know, those pills are expensive. That's why Mark Trash is not really on them too tough, you know, because it can really mess you up. Because that's what explains a lot to you guys about all those opportunities where he's just been, you're like, raw, oh, fam, seriously, all you have to do was pass, like, seriously? Like, Mark Trash, think, think, think. And with Marcus Rashford taking that pill, Again, for Bruno Fernandes to just dummy it to Daniel James. And then after that, Bruno Fernandes himself finishing it off, making it 2-0. Then Pagan tried to make it on offside, but nah, it did not work today. Because why? Bruno Fernandes was onside. And if that was his 21st goal of the season, guys, boy, oh boy, oh boy, our savior is doing a thing right now, you know. 21st goal of the season from a midfielder, guys, and 11 assists. Not only doing his job, but scoring the goals. But apart from that, I have to say, his whole gameplay was trash. His whole gameplay was trash, guys. Like, I'm, I'm not blinded by it. Right? All those goals and those assists are very good. Um, what was it? A very good deodorant to mask all those smells. But me... Nah fam, those deodorants don't work. For you to do that, you have to put perfume. And perfume is you mean performing well fam. And of course, my guy Marcus Rashford, Sir Marcus Rashford, the guy who's feeding the whole country in the UK's kids out here. Like, he thought to himself, nah, let me go to Italy and help out and give it to Ross Ossie as well. A lovely goal, cool finish as well. Limitless pill was working at that moment there. I was like, 
Yes, I knew that was going to be a goal because you can see it coming. Like Mark Swisher was not going to make a mistake for this one at this time. Brilliant assist by Fred, Pastor Frederick, passing his sermons all over that grass. You know he was brilliant. He was fantastic, man. Just preaching, giving out prayers, telling people you shall not pass. Throwing holy water. The power of Christ compel you to those real saucy that defenders and, and midfielders. Trust me, you get me. And then of course. DJ, freaking freaking Daniel James scored, making it 4-0. I thought he was going to give it to my boy Ahmed Diallo and shout out to Ahmed Diallo on the debut for him. But Daniel James, you should have slotted it into him. But I can understand why you wanted to be greedy. You wanted to rock the house, rock the party today. Because I did tell you that no one's booking you, big man. You don't know how to mix right these days, DJ. But today, you got a couple of tracks good. You've kind of done some couple of good mixing today. You know, you didn't... F up today, you know, but DJ, well done, bruv, because you know that we haven't seen you and it's been a long time and you ain't getting those bookings anymore, bruv. But it's glad to see that you've got a booking today with Oli God and Social against Raw Saucy, Dad, bruv. You turned it up today, bruv. Big up Daniel James, bruv. He did well. I gotta say, he did well, bruv. I'm not gonna hate. Full time Manchester United 4, Raw Saucy, Dad, nil. Please with that, guys, for like. We just got four goals up with second leg. It's going to be easy, man. We just kind of just like we can sit back, relax, guys. My overall thought was that boom, we did our thing. My man in the match has to be Fred, guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Honestly, like I said, Pastor Frederick serving those summons. You shall not pass, you know, all the time to them guys out here, you know, you know, telling people like Marcus Rashford, you know. In Jesus Christ, you know, it's in you, bruv. Because he needed that, bruv. He needed Jesus in him and he done a thing in the second half. Looking at Bruno Fernandes, you know, boom. He already knows he's the chosen one. He was trying to ask Bruno Fernandes to baptise him because, of course, Bruno is the, you know, the long and missing saviour of Manchester United, you know. Biblical terms out here, if you want me, if you want to try and understand what I mean by that, bruv. But, you know... Today, no donkey of the match, you know, no one deserves a donkey of the match. It's been a good game. It's been a good performance from the guys. So no one really deserves a donkey match. If I have to give it to anyone, it got to be those Seville defenders. Because they're conceded and, those go and that goalkeeper ate a lot of goals today, guys. Guys, this has been your match reaction from Ivor and Spice, guys. And as always, remember to subscribe, smash that like button. Remember to share. Remember to share to people that you like, people that you don't like. And girls, remember to share it to your ex, your current boyfriend as well, or your male friends as well. And then tell them exactly you found a guy that does it way better than you, fam. And as usual, remember to follow the official Instagram account of Red United TV, which is Red United TV One, baby. And also the official TikTok account, which is Red United TV. And remember to follow me on my personal socials, which is Ivorian underscore Spice. All that across Twitter and also the Snapchat. And as always, guys, remember to keep it united. And remember to keep it Red United. Until next time, peace out.